So, uh, a few of your former clubs that we want to get your thoughts yes, on. Yes, there's a few. Uh, there is a few as and well. And a few, a few <laughs> big topics and reports in the newspapers. Harry Kane being linked to Manchester United once again is one of them. Ooh. 18 months left on his contract. Yeah. If you were his advisor, would you tell him to go or stay? <laughs> That's a tough one. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> should we enter in a, we I've got a tough one. No, listen, listen. Who's going to win the league? He, he, he's very headstrong. He's, he's an international footballer. He's got all these goals. He's goal scoring. But is he uh, England? Has he beat Rooney yet? No, no, he's going to get, he's going to beat that. But Jimmy Greaves, he has. Hopefully, so. yeah, Tot- that's right at Tottenham. So he's, 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 he's his own man. I don't think anyone could tell him agents, family, whatever. I mean, he's got to make the choice himself, and I think he's headstrong, and it's down to him. No one else can influence him at that stage of his career. Mm. I mean, four years ago, yeah, maybe agents or other clubs getting involved, but thirty-one, Jimmy Greaves, thirty-one. You know what I mean? He's, he's, he's yeah. got to do it for himself now. You on that fence there? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think he's got to do it himself. Does, yeah. he, does he fancy or don't he fancy? I mean, he's got young kids now. He's got to take them out of school. He's got to move them to Manchester. What do you do? Mm. Ali, yeah, says, Ali, Ali, Ali says go. How, hey, help me. <laughs> Ali, help me. Quick. Perf- you're perfectly balanced. <laughs> Is that good? <laughs> Was that a great argument, Your Honour? <laughs> Not guilty? But I mean, you never told me you're running for a politician as well. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sensible now, I'm fit. <laughs> I've never sat on the fence in my life because he's a broke the fence with the pump. I mean, what's happened to him? <laughs> he's going to be sitting in the House of Commons <laughs> next given us a hearing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, do you want me to move on? No, that yeah. was great. I yeah. think, well, Alan, what do you think you two? I think he's going. Do you think he's going? And I'll tell you, you why. Mean, it's, it's his last chance. Uh, yeah, that's why. And I think that Jimmy Greaves' record was massive, yeah. massive for him. And they want to beat Alan Shearer's record, and they want to win things, Razor. And I just think at this moment in time, he's got a better chance of doing it in Manchester. I'm, I'm glad possible. you said that because I agree with you. You said it. <laughs> 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 no, 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 listen, he's got to do what he's going to do, but you know, does he want to win things? Is he happy? Is his life perfect in yeah. London? If he wants to win things, he's got to go because Tottenham ain't winning nothing, and I love him. Okay, fair enough. Liverpool smashed Manchester United 7 0. Did they? Did I mean, know, it's not been on the news. Because the thing about it, they don't go on about it. Like, it's like, I didn't know the Beatles. Do you know the Beatles are from Liverpool? Because they no. don't mind going on about that either, do they? <laughs> and they haven't gone on about this 7 0 much, have they? It was, I was, and after the fourth goal, I was laughing. It was amazing, wasn't it? I was laughing. And the best thing about all their players getting upset, that even makes. As a player, I know. when you're in that situation and you see their players getting the ump, it's hilarious. It was when Trent Trent threw the ball at Fernandez. Oh, you could see him getting angry. Mate. I bet Trent's running off laughing. And then, 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 like... then people were running past him. He's, you know, <laughs> Chrissy Waddle. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? It was isn't it great. It's when you play, it's great as watching. But when you're actually there and you see it playing, against them, oh, this is good. And then you go straight up to them after and try and take their hand. <laughs> do, do you think, I can't remember what the phrase is, is it one swallow doesn't make a summer? Yes. Thank God for that. Yes, so, yes, do yes, you, yes it is. Yeah, thank you. Do you, yeah, do you think now that's the turning point for Liverpool? Um, no, maybe maybe could go the other way. Oh, I mean, it's one of them. You know really? what I mean? Oh, we, we are really good again. But I, I think that the situation, I listen to your shows, listen, you know, we watch Match of the Days and that and, you know, Liverpool having a bad time, but I think other teams ain't bad now, you know. No oh, one man. else give teams have credit. Well, no by the way, like Brighton. Brighton beat Brentford. them twice. Brentford. Brighton Brentford. are excellent. Wolves, Wolves beat them. Yeah. They're good teams you come up playing against. You know what I mean? If 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 three of three of your team are having a bad game, you're gonna get beat. Then that is every Saturday. So mm-hmm. it's you know, you gotta to have to give credit to the other teams. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Liverpool were flying, but they were all flying at the same time. Two or three of them having a bad game, the other team played more players yep. play better, yeah. which I think the other teams have improved now and they know the way Liverpool play. They don't leave themselves so open now. You've got to give credit to the other teams. OK, uh, another hard one. <laughs> West Ham that was quite easy. Trouble. I didn't think that was hard. I thought uh, it was no, quite no, easy no. and I explained it, was, it well, Laura. It was, kind of, it was more the Harry Kane one that I was referring yes. to as the hard question. Go, but, get uh, rid of him. He's rubbish. <laughs> How about that? Is that better? <laughs> West Ham. Are West Ham yes. in trouble? Do you think they'll survive? Big trouble. They are in, in big trouble. It's, it's a merry-go-round at the bottom. I mean, this is how football is. I mean... Just over, just under, well, just over a year ago, West Ham was sitting pretty at fifth or fourth, were yeah. they? Arsenal was sitting twelfth, thirteenth mm-hmm. in a year. Do you know what I mean? So they are, they are in trouble. I think that the fans have got to be easing them because it is a tough place to play. If you're having a bad time at West Ham, the fans let you know, and I think the fans have got to understand that. You know what I mean? Get behind them. They need you behind them now. Don't pick on a player or two players that are having a bad time. Get mm-hmm. behind the team. They need to. The, if they ever needed a thirteenth man, yeah, twelfth, thirteenth man. Now they need them now. They, they don't need twelfth. They need a thirteenth man, fourteenth man, fifteenth <laughs> man from the crowd. 
Do you think they should be picking on David Moyes? Or do you think that he's... No, get behind everybody. Get behind everybody. You know, happy manager, better manager. Happy footballer, better footballer. Yeah. To get behind everybody. And it's as simple as that. What a lovely way it's of looking at it. not rocket science. Razor, lovely to see you. Thank, thank you, you very you much. So Good much. to see you, mate. Top thank you. Thank you Can I say thank you my wife, my beautiful wife. I love her so much. I'd, lo- I'd like to say thank you for sticking behind... Be- sticking... Be- be- <laughs> so that's how it works. <laughs> <laughs> you are. Sticking with me. Stay behind me. Are you sticking t- with me. Will you shut up? Are you trying to get us I feel my beautiful what? wife <laughs> to stick in with me when I was a bad boy and sitting there being lazy and now I'm proud of you and I hope you're proud of me. Lovely. Is that it, me? I, I can't speak anymore, Annie, now. <laughs> I think my tongue's lost too much weight. <laughs> Talk Sport Breakfast with Laura Woods. Monday to Wednesday morning, 6 till 10. On AM, on DAB, via the Talk Sport app and on your smart speaker. Talk Sport.